Cincinnati's certified most accurate forecast. Well, it's been a beautiful weekend, sunshine on both Saturday and Sunday, and this afternoon, high temperatures in the 70s. And look at this, we're still in the 60s, so a nice, comfortable evening here. 64 in Harrison, 63 in Falmouth, 62 in Hillsborough, and 63 degrees in Wilmington. Nothing to track on the radar. In fact, we're going to stay dry tonight, but we will be watching as a couple high clouds slowly drift down from the north. Again, at the airport, 65 are winds out of the southwest at 9 miles an hour, and it's those southwesterly winds which are helping to keep our temperatures a little higher than you'd normally expect here in the middle of October. Now, high pressure has been protecting us all weekend long, keeping us with these southerly winds on Sunday and helping our temperatures to climb. But overnight, this cold front's going to move in. Now, most of the time when you have a cold front, we're talking about showers and thunderstorms. But this system coming through with very little fanfare. In fact, just a few clouds for us. And then by tomorrow, you'll feel that drop in temperatures as winds turn to the north and we start to siphon down some of this cooler air. 43 in Marquette, 49 in Minneapolis, 40 in Pier. So again, you can see the cooler air right up along the U.S. Canadian border. Again, that cooler air starting to press into the Ohio Valley. It's just going to take a little time. So overnight, temperatures gradually dropping to a low of 50 degrees. Tomorrow morning, we rapidly climb into the 60s, but notice how today we are up around 72, 73. Tomorrow, only 62. And I say only 62 because this is pretty typical for what you'd see in October. 64 is our average high. Future cast showing quiet conditions overnight. As we head into tomorrow morning, there will be a few passing clouds from time to time, especially to the north and east of Cincinnati. But as we head on through the day, we all see sun sunshine and our temperatures again because of that sunshine will start to climb into the lower 60s. As we end to Tuesday, a few high clouds drifting in from the west, but really nothing that's going to change our weather too much. In fact, as we head into Tuesday afternoon, we're talking about highs in the lower 60s and Wednesday, a brief spike up in temperatures before another cold front comes through, giving us our best chance for rain on Thursday and some slightly cooler weather for the end of the week. So your forecast tonight, 50 degrees, not quite as cool as it has been the last couple of nights, but Still on the chilly side, especially in some outlying areas. Tomorrow afternoon, a high of 62 with mostly sunny skies. All around, things are looking pretty good. Tuesday, pretty much a repeat of Monday, a high of 60. Wednesday, we turn breezy. Temperatures begin to climb a little bit. That'll be one of the warmer days this week. And then as our cold front moves through, we'll have some clouds and some showers late Wednesday night into early Thursday. And then as we head into Friday, some sunshine. And right now, a question mark on next weekend. We may have a larger system move through, which could drop our temperatures potentially as early as Sunday and perhaps even some freezing temperatures by Monday and Tuesday morning. All right.